lamp and bulb, even Christmas lights can work well for creating softer light. My laptop is kind of cockeyed and the reason I did that was because I want to avoid that window that's over there because you can see what it kind of does to the light in the room. I will say that the light is coming through and bouncing off this white wall which is helpful but otherwise there's only a regular lamp which is to my right but I do have a couple of clip light like hardware type light. I think a lot of folks have these lying around in their houses. They're pretty inexpensive to get. But I have that clamped above me facing another white wall that's behind my computer. I can add a bunch of light and you'll see how it is now bouncing onto my skin. You can see when you're messing with your lights that your web camera will respond. As you move the light around, you'll see hot spots on the lighter parts of your skin. Depending on what the purpose of your video is, you can play around with different types of lighting. And really, we're just talking about working with what you have. I think something else that's important is just making sure that wherever you are, you feel comfortable, that you can have a relaxed conversation with the people that you're talking to. I generally try to keep the lighting pretty low key. The most important thing is that you can see who you're talking to.